Hey planner friends, I am back with you today uh, to record um, a week overview of planning in my daily duo. And I do air quotes because I have printed off a template that somebody had um, made previous off of the daily duo pages and vamped it for my own um, liking. I don't get up at six like the daily duo has in there even if I was I wasn't doing I'm not doing anything at that point um so I have changed it to 8 a.m to 9 p.m um I've also taken out the calendar here there's also going to be a few other things that I kind of um tweak here in the next week or so and you'll see like usually this line isn't here either um I accidentally printed it with that line it's no big deal to me but I have also, then I can also punch it to go on my HP disc. So, because I am not a coil person and yeah, I just, though I have ones that are, are on coil and then I still punch them or actually it's in the binder inserts. This is cleaner. So I've been just sticking to this. It's been working amazing. I am going to go back and show you how last week came out. So this was Monday. I keep it nice and simple, as you can see. Um, it was our second week of virtual learning, so we're kind of getting into the gist of things. You can see lots of things going on. This was the end of the TPC sale. No, 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 this was the week after. No, this is the week end of the TPC sale, yes. I'm like, hold on, I can't remember. Um, I loved, um, this is my um, neutral pumpkin. Um, daily duo kit i love this kit like i said i kept it nice and simple all the way through um let's see here not much going on on tuesday but still just marking down the main things that i need to get done mainly for my little guy in school um oh you know what? i wanted to go through and make some scripts up for that and i did not and i don't want them for this week um, Wednesday I got, um, a, I decided to only half it because if I do it this way, there's just no spots for me to write what I want to get done. So I seen somebody else doing it where they kind of halved it for the stuff that the school need to get it done and then things that I needed to get done. I liked it. It worked well for me. So, um, I'll probably start doing this again. So, because there just isn't that much that I need to be writing down for them. Um, especially my oldest. So, you know, he's keeping track of it. It's just for my youngest. So, all right. Um, this day, I didn't have much going on this day. This was our anniversary. Um, and I just didn't do much in the morning. I just designed a Christmas kit. Um, I had started testing for my son and the anniversary again, Friday. It was a pretty chill day for me. Um, and I didn't, get much done. I mean, I got a lot done. I was just, I didn't put a much in there. I skipped Saturday because I had a wedding all day. If you're um, new to my channel, I am also a wedding photographer. Um, so Saturday was pretty much taken up by getting ready for the wedding and going to the wedding. So I just didn't fill in a Saturday. It kind of worked out because then I didn't waste another piece of paper. So, um, but Sunday definitely had a ton going on. My son had a double header for baseball, which took way too long. Then my other son had practice and it was my mom's birthday. Also our puppy's birthday. He turned one. So there's that. So yay for getting that done. Um, you will see that I did not get the weekly done. Um, last week it just, it didn't get done. I'm going to go back in memory plan up though. I have decided that I am going to go back in memory plan. So what we are going to do now is start getting, I need to get today set up. And as you can see, I've already started at least with my to-do because I have, it's 11 o'clock. It's about the only time that I can get down here to start filming because of um, distance learning. Um, but I needed to get at least a checklist done. I have pulled out at least the headers that I'm going to be using today is from the BE. PD shop. Love her shop. Um, this is folly, but didn't call too much fall because I'm going to go fall crazy in my, um, weekly since fall begins tomorrow. So yeah, um, I think it will match great. So 
I'm going to show you kind of how I set up. I'm just going to set up the days um, and put the main things that are going to be in here. This week is a little bit of a chill week since last week was pretty busy. Um, yeah, so it, it's a little bit of a chill week. I did not get her full kit. So I know the one thing that I've been seeing on like the Facebook groups and reforms is that buying stickers for this daily duo is kind of expensive um if you want to get all the kits and all that kind of stuff because you're literally planning for i mean you're planning on seven pages so you can understand why it is expensive um i mean i understand as a sticker shop i understand why it's expensive um because it's a lot of stickers guys <laughs> um you are planning over seven pages instead of two so there's a ton more um spots to decorate and to cover and all that kind of stuff so keep that in mind but one way that i have been keeping my own you know budget down including obviously i make my own stickers but when i do want stickers from other shops is i get um the headers so as you can see here i get the headers um here's the kit that i was looking for luna hold on I'm gonna, this is the other way i was doing it which I ended up using this art and not even knowing about it later. Um, Luna loves um, Sticker Co. Also does like a daily page. But like I said, this starts getting expensive. This is like $4 a sheet. Um, so like I said before, I will get the headers and I will just use all of my own stickers that I already have um, for the rest of it. So with my kits, I'm going to show you how also you can save money in my own shop. So with my own shop, um, I will do the headers like you've seen before. These are just the headers and then just the event labels. So these two combined will get you a full week of stickers and you get the washi strips uh, for six fifty, I believe. Um, I believe, no, 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 no. I'm sorry. This is five and this is two fifty. So for seven fifty for the week. Um, now will you get all of the boxes to cover all of this up? And, and then if you wanted scripts, it's one other dollar. Um, so that's eight fifty. That's not bad for a full week of stickers and, um, that kind of stuff. So uh, kind of think about how you can keep the, you know, the cost down. I will show you throughout this weekly um, plan with me um, how, like, I use my own, um, uh, how do I say it, um, my own, like, handwriting or doodling. Um, I do a lot of, like, doodling of boxes um, to keep the cost down. So I'll show you all that in this video and I'm hoping that helps all of you daily duo people keep the cost down because there was, yeah, um, when I first got into this planner and was going kind of crazy, I was like, whoa, like one week can cost like $21 and you can do the same in your weekly spreads. Trust me. Um, I just, um, I just don't buy kits like the foil kits. You can get pretty darn expensive with those. So I also chose to do the template because I do need a separate day for Saturday and Sunday. So this is another reason I don't, I have not went and just bought the daily duo is because oh oh her stickers are not cut okay her stickers are the amazing creamy paper um so it's just not ah oh, no hold on ah it's gonna cut it oh that's so disappointing Karen ah well, 
We're going to have to figure out something for that. Darn nabbit. All right. And Sunday, and now I get a need. Some extra adhesive for this part. I'll have to figure it out. <laughs> it's okay. Again, if you know anything about my channel, I am not a crazy person about what happens. And I don't have to worry about it until Saturday. Honestly, I won't worry about it until Saturday. So loving just all the colors and all that kind of stuff. Now, because I am a sticker shop and I can, um, most of the time I will go and match colors and do my own event label stickers. But today we're not going to do that. Today we are just going to doodle and use what we have. So I think I'm going to use, um, I am using the Papermate Inkjoy, um, 0.7, the Tombow Fudu Siku, however you pronounce that, um, hard tip. Um, I always use hard tip for my calligraphy and I think a mild liner. I think the gray mild liner will work. Yeah. Fantastic for this. Um, and just kind of playing out my day. So, um, it is the 21st, right? Again, I didn't buy date stickers. You can either just write it in or, yep, 21st. And if you don't like your own handwriting, then there's like probably kits that you haven't used the date stickers off of before. I know like all of the planner Kate stickers come with um, all of the, you know, dates and you don't use the dates on every single one. So reuse dates. That's how we're going to, even my own kits. Like I could, I could have used, so this was the kit from last week. Um, I obviously didn't use the 21, 22, 23. I could have used those. You don't need the day stickers every darn time you buy a kit. Okay. So, um, I did not work out this morning. Um, and I have been just putting in, like I said, school and my, my ruler has been MIA for a minute now. <laughs> I cannot find my darn ruler. It is somewhere, but I cannot find that darn thing. So I am just going to go here and mark my kids' school. And as you can see, I just use dashes. Sometimes I use straight lines. I do love the dash look. Now is where I got to like... I don't know where halfway is. I don't have too much going on in the morning to where um, if I don't get it exactly right, it's not the biggest deal in the world. Today I had a few more to do's in the morning I needed to get done, but um, I'm going to actually leave that because I'm going to get a script that says school about that. All right. So my oldest is in first hour here, second hour here, and third hour there. Um, and actually this week he trans, the next week he transfers over to his th fourth, fifth, and sixth hour next week. So he does have a few open houses that I need to get the dates of and all of that jazz. But my youngest has, um, what does he have? Music. 12, 20. Music. And this is when I have to like pull him out of lunch. So that that's, this is why I mark these things. The other ones from nine to 11, the teacher pretty much takes him through all of that from 12 to two is when I have to like take him out of one class and put him into another class and all that kind of stuff. So, and then it was like, into, um, he has an art thing at one Oh five. And then Tech X. There we go. Okay, today we had 
a YouTube video go live. So excited that I got that all up last night. Go me. Guys, I am really trying to hit some crazy goals this week or this month. And I'm getting there, but I'm starting to fall short. I'm losing steam. Um, but hopefully this week I can pull it back together. But marker review. I probably need to promote that too. So I mark review and then I needed to um, put in my grocery order. So there we go. Much easier. So my kids eat 10,000 pounds of oatmeal and they only like the Quaker oatmeal with, of course, that is chocked full of, you know, sugar. So it's not the good oatmeal for them. Um, but it is on sale. Like literally my kids eat like three bags a sitting. It's on sale this week. So I just ordered like 15 boxes of it. <laughs> so, um, yeah, I needed to order groceries this morning so we can check that off. Um, I just, what time is it? It is 12 o'clock right now. So I am importing my wedding images here because I'm on top of it and so we did that and sounds actually like my husband's gonna clean the kitchen so yay I'm trying to get this done I need to actually go and put them out of the thing and then I'm filming so that's what I wanted to put here I have to remember to use these things I need to put them in my sticker book Yeah. Okay. And I want to put this here because I want to, I am obviously filming there. Okay. Next up is that's kind of how my Monday goes. That's kind of how I set up um, each day. All right, here we are on Tuesday. As you can see, this video is already getting pretty long and I am just needing to speed this up a little bit. So on Tuesday, I didn't speak anyways very much um, while I was doing this. So we're just going to go through this and it kind of gets repetitive anyways in the Daily Duo, which is one thing A, I do like and these sometimes I don't like. Um, but as you can see, I just made my gray box to go and signify school. Other than that, today we didn't have much. All we had was a scrimmage for my youngest. Yes, that's right. Oh, and my oldest went to practice at the same exact time. So you'll just see me writing that in and then my to-do list. Quite often, you will see me doing my to-do list and then also putting those tasks also on the left side. I just like to do that so that I know about what time that I want to do them so that I schedule my day through, but also so I can check them off. And if I'm checking two things off of the same, hey, I live to check things off. So that works for me. Lastly, this is just the first day of fall, so I was going through all my Christine and Design stickers to find it's a fall sticker um, for this spread along with one 
actually for my weekly spread too. All right, today you can see on Wednesday, um, I last night we were watching a movie and I just kind of filled in a few things that I wanted to get done today um, that either A, didn't get done on Tuesday, as you can see here. Um, I had a few things that didn't get done, um, but all in all, yesterday was pretty productive. Um, if you watched my plan with me that actually just went live this morning, as you just seen, um, movie night actually got moved to yesterday, Tuesday instead of Monday. Um, but yeah, so kids are in school. Um, I kind of liked the whole, um, highlighter type deal yesterday. And I know gray isn't quite in the same thing, but gray matches everything. And then I kind of just put a line down the middle today. That wasn't the straightest line, but ooh well. Leaving this side for my kids' school. And the other side for stuff for me. So we got that done. Other than that, today I just have to work on some editing of a session that I edited yesterday already. <laughs> Um, but a okay. Um, I think I'm gonna mix in this kit with this one because I mean all of the fall colors kind of match. To put a today sticker, and I'm not gonna use all those stickers anyways. So today, um, so I just wanted to remind myself that I wanted to film this day in the life of. Of course, later on I'm going to film the October monthly. So probably when I get back from my workout yeah um so i've already hung out and did video comments i also loaded the dishwasher and you know i am all for writing things on my to-do list to check them off loaded dishwasher <laughs> anyways that is actually going to entail unloading dishwasher and reloading it um to get the kitchen cleaned but i also want to clean my room because that didn't get done i don't i don't think there's gonna be too much more and I'm not sure about structuring my night right now like we don't have anything for appointment wise at this point it's gonna be a pretty chill night dinner is tacos so I will put that in there put that in here and then like I said I'm probably just gonna I won't get home until almost probably 4.30-ish if I'm going to the library. Um, so I think we'll put here. Perfect. Um, all the while, like I said, and I need to edit this portrait session. But I kind of do, at this point... I know I talked to you guys at another plan with me or a day in the life, I think, or something like that, that I wanted to get on some type of schedule for my businesses, like one day working on photography, one day working on stickers. Right now, it's really working out that I'm just editing during the school time because my editing computer is upstairs still. Um, and then everything for plan with K is just afterwards because that's down here in my base, in my office. So... That's kind of just how we're working on it right now. Other than that, I will see you tomorrow. Today is Thursday. Welcome back. I have a little bit of a mess going here, but let's get into it today. Well, let's go through and figure out what I actually didn't do yesterday or did do. All right, so I did do a little bit of that, even though we're going to transfer that into today. Um, I did not get to October monthly, so we'll try and get that done today. I did half of the library books. I accidentally took the wrong one. I did print and cut freebies, but I still have a few more I need to do. I did not get to that. Loaded, yes. I actually did do that, and I did do that. Yay! So, I just didn't get to this because my actual, my workout moved to four. 
Um, and it just kind of messed up a little bit. And then I came down and played with things for my December daily and maybe a few different things for the shop um, that I'm actually quite excited about. So, um, yeah, I didn't do exactly what I was supposed to be doing yesterday. All right, so I'm actually doing this kind of late today. My workout was here and done. Yay. It is, what, the 24th? It's really bad on that coil or on that those discs um school is in progress and guys oh my goodness school the last like two days has been going so freaking well i don't know where my mild liner is it's been going so well guys like i'm so excited i think that the teacher is just finally getting the groove for my little one and they're starting to figure out where they need to go ah so good. Okay. So I do know he has tech X at 150 that I need to get him on for. Um, I don't know what his 1220 class is. I have to go and look that up and then we'll figure out homework. Um, today, um, I've just been going through emails today. Um, and then I showered which I've ended up picking these up for because honestly, I put shower in my planner more than probably normal people or I literally just like don't ever make it there. So especially with the kids in virtual learning, I don't know when is the best time to like go up for my son. But like I said, it's been like getting so good and he's been figuring things out now. I don't know how his focus is when I'm not doing that but I'm also down in my office right now and don't know how his focus is right now but he's nearing the lunch period so he should be okay um they should be going on break here soon um today Jamin has baseball practice make a Michael's run here. Um, I'm not positive yet. Other than that, today is pretty open. Um, we do need to make a run to my kids baseball team office lock cart money drop. I need to go pay the bill. Um, I need to go do that. So we'll probably go do that at three. We might also take back that other library book with that. And we might do the Michaels run then. I'm not positive how I want to do things at this point. Um, other than that, we need to just transfer over things like... So I have to revamp those. I got to go back to the drawing board because you guys said on my Instagram, if you do not follow me on my Instagram, definitely follow me over there because you'll see there and in my Facebook group, um, where I try and get lots of opinions from you guys on different stickers. And over there last night, um, I definitely needed help on these stickers that I just said that I thought the numbers were too small and you guys confirmed that. So, um, it's just a lot of helpfulness for me. So that is about it for today. All right. Welcome back. It is Friday. This will probably be the last day that I do this. Uh, cause my Saturday and Sunday, Sunday will be like full of baseball and I won't be able to. And, um, I don't know, maybe we'll do it t tomorrow. I might do Saturday. Um, I don't have my children tomorrow. They are going to be with their grandparents. So tomorrow is going to be a nice lazy day. Today, on the other hand, it is 1.30. 1.30? No, it's like 1.15. 1.07. And I'm just now getting down here. Let me tell you. It was a stressful virtual learning day. <laughs> 
Um, my day in the life is not posted. It might get posted today. I actually will probably be working on that when I get home from dropping off my kids to hopefully get that posted tonight. Um, if not, it will go up tomorrow. We'll kind of see. It might, I just might leave it until tomorrow. Friday nights are not the best night to post. Um, so yeah, let's start out. <laughs> I'm going to kind of be back planning, I guess, at this point. You're about to see that my oldest, so if you haven't been with us before, my oldest is taking his hours one through three, the first three weeks, four through six, the next three weeks, and they transfer back and forth. At the end of the three weeks, is all of their tests. It's pretty much what we figured out. So Friday, he has tests in every single one of his classes. He told me he had it all down and we practiced a lot of math because um, these two classes are actually high school classes. He's eighth grade. He's 12 years old in the eighth grade. So he's a very young eighth grader and he's in high math classes and high Spanish classes. Um, so he told me he had everything down for Spanish. No big deal, mom. I have it. Math we did practice a lot on, but we probably could have done a little bit more, but I think we, he was good on that. Um, and that did not go so well. So <laughs> um, I was dealing with that this morning and talking to the teacher and figuring out what we can do. And it ended up being okay, honestly. Um, he ended up actually getting a B and the teacher had made a couple of problems. So we're good there now. Anyway, so very stressful morning. I still don't have the Chromebook working. It is what it is. All right, next here. I don't know who's pounding upstairs. I am dropping off kids. I should be like running and getting a drink after this drop off kids. <laughs> I, am, I literally hadn't even like gotten a bite to eat until noon. It was crazy. Um, and then at this point, it's a girl's night out. Yay. Cause I can need this more than ever. <music> Other things I had to do in here. So yeah, so we're here. We're in the middle of a science test. Everything will be okay. <laughs> Other than that, that's our Friday. So what I am going to do with you, well, actually, I don't know. I have no idea because I don't know what my Saturday is going to look like. My Saturday is going to look like a ton of to-do lists. Oh, I forgot that that happened. And this is just going to be baseball. that I will fill out to-do list once I get there tomorrow. I have no idea. Tomorrow might be like working non-stop since I don't have the boys. Um, and I would love for it to be relaxing, but I need to clean also. So it's, there's no way it's going to be relaxing. Ooh, this went outside the lines. All right. Thank you guys so much for being here. That was, is probably going to conclude. I'm probably not going to update this Saturday. We'll see if I do tomorrow. If I do, I'll just delete what I'm saying right now. Um, and yeah, that is my full week in my daily duo. Um, it, you know, some days, like I said, it's more than others. So thank you guys so much for being here and I will see you in the next one.